last night. Of course, it's a hard condition, but it's a good challenge to make it happen. All right, we are in my garage, my house in, in Switzerland, in Grangette. It's a small town that's a place for my e-bikes. Next door, we have, uh, it's pretty funny, we have the car of uh, my father-in-law. We have the car and we have the smell too. It's, uh, that's the bad part, but uh, it's pretty funny. Uh, for me, for a Swiss guy, it's so amazing to ride my dirt bike in Lax. Like a snowboarder or skier. I don't have rail here and I cannot go to Lax and try directly to the place that will take so much time that I have to build one here at home. You know, I, I really love to work on my garage, try to find the best solution to do new stuff, make me think of what I want to do, what I want to practice on and uh, just uh, find energy to, to do it. Okay, then that's my e-bike. It's pretty cool, you know, for motocross uh, riders. It's pretty much the same. It's two wheels, one engine, and one throttle gas. The two first week, I was like, yeah, let's try to get used to it. But I always looking for the clutch, and I always feeling bad if I, I don't have it. Then we build like a fake uh, level here. The balance of the bike, it's, it's, uh, it's very good, actually. It's very close to the, to the regular bike. That will be the two bikes that I take to, uh, to Lux. We do a couple of tests. The bike's running good and cold. Uh, just we have to take care about the battery. That would be a mission to keep the bike as uh, warmer than we can and keep the rider warmer than we can too. <laughs> How I get uh, to do this motocross sports? Uh, it's a family sport. You know, all the family, uh, it's motocross riders. I'm the third generation riding a uh, um, dirt bike. I want to say 16, I start to, to doing tricks and stuff like this. I do my first freestyle show, I want to say, in Lax. It was just a show. It starts pretty much like that. X Fighters time was just a, a dream come true for me. We traveling a lot, always on such a nice place. And now I ride my e-bike on place where you can uh, never think it's possible. My biggest dream will be to ride on the moon. <laughs> bon, pas direction Lex. Right now, you know, it's the first time that we go up. Uh, pretty stressed. Pretty exciting to see how is the landing, how is the, the snow. Hopefully, everything is good. But uh, it's actually the first day that we have uh, time to, uh, to figure out the best way to do it. We see how it is. I guess Lux is now really known like worldwide. It's on that level as X Games or a US Open. It got me really curious when I heard uh, that Matt wants to hit the slopes out here in Lux. And it's challenging and uh, I think it's a great idea. Uh, the ramp uh, will be like actually 23 meters from here. That will be a pretty good condition. Là, il est un peu comme ça. Si t'arrives, on va juste prendre un peu là. Ouais. Et puis, en fait, couper là. Voilà. Ouais. En gros. Ouais. Mais, euh, mais pas, pas beaucoup, juste, euh, un, juste un petit peu, ouais. 
Ça marche. Merci beaucoup. De rien. The difficulties on snow, it's the snow change all day long. And to have the right snow and the right feeling on the snow, it's very hard. Then you have to find the right moment of the day where the snow, it's okay to, to ride on it. Time to try the ramp. Very exciting to learn, to learn a lot of things, see uh, how the snow reacts. Have a solid crew behind me, and uh, my dad is here with the bike, it's ready, I'm ready. I've been waiting for this moment for pretty long now, and uh, yeah, very excited. So if anything, it's not supposed to snow this morning, but... The cool thing with uh, with e-bike, it's no noise, no smell, no gas. Then you can uh, you can ride in the nature. Everything is fine, can I try? The same, go to the mountain, uh, have the permission with the, with the station and everything with a regular bike will be, will be very hard. You know, it's like everything's white. I'm not used to it, and when I'm here, it's super hard to see where I am. Actually, I'm lost. <laughs> Between me and you, I prefer dirt for sure. <laughs> it's quite, uh, it's quite cool. Waiting for the time that you can ride, and when you ride, you have to be 100 percent. I just uh, try to think about all the the tricks that I want to do. It's quite the same than when you're on a competition. fun on this morning that was shaping like super clean and super nice that was uh, actually good time very good flow on a bike that was pretty crazy it was super cold it was min minus 15 but even like when it's so beautiful like this and you don't feel it it's just like uh, yeah it's magic moment for sure <laughs> I'm pretty happy, uh, that was a, a very cool project. Of course, it's uh, the hardest project I ever did. Everything was hard, pretty much, on this project, but, uh, but it's, just, uh, it's just cool, because I think we, we definitely shoot something special, and so, something magic, and you know, with this view, it's quite amazing. I thought that, that, was, that was tough and scary sometimes.